praktischer georiënteerd en ook operationeler zijn bij de, zijn bij de cassave teelt. Dit willen landbouwers die meedoen met het Value Chain Platform van het Suriname Agriculture Market Access Project SAMAP. Erik Ceballos, Chief Technical Advisor van de internationale landbouworganisatie FAO, deelde deze informatie met de redactie tijdens de negende Value Chain Platform Meeting van de SAMAP. Hij stelt dat de bedoeling van deze workshop is om te bespreken wat beter te doen in de toekomst. One important message that they want to work this year is to be more practical oriented, more operational, so the farmers in the field can feel and can be part of the implementation of the plans. The processors also have to integrate more with the farmers so they can complement each other, help each other and the exporters also play a role in this exercise. So the 2023 plan is action oriented, hands on, is not, not one person that is going to resolve all the problems, it's not just the government, it's not just this institution, it's not just sum up, it's all together and for that they are organizing in small groups, task forces, so in 2023 they will implement three or four priorities for the benefit of the whole value chain. Sebaius merkt op dat de opgedane kennis en ervaring die vandaag is gedeeld tijdens de workshop gebruikt zal worden om in 2023 beter werk te verzetten als het aankomt op cassave teelt. Hij stelt dat de ontwikkelingen binnen de, binnen de sector uitdagend zijn. There is a lot of enthusiasm. There is still a lot of uh, belief and hope that the sector can contribute to the economy of the country. But at the same time, they are facing lots of problems. The climate change, the rains in the last year have affected the, the plots of many farmers. Many have lost their production. Others have to shift to other areas or to other products. There are lots of problems that have to do also with irrigation. They are not managing well the drainage of their lands, therefore the plants are having diseases and they are dying as well. Planting material is not enough. Not enough production in certain types of cassava. The yellow cassava is in deficit, the prices go up. That's an opportunity for producers, but it's a challenge for consumers. So those are the questions that they are discussing. The solutions are not easy. It's hard to control the rain. Yeah. But is perhaps possible to manage your production system. Sebaio zegt dat het de bedoeling is dat de landbouwers samenwerken om de sector tot bloei te brengen en de problemen waarmee ze kampen weg te werken. De FAO-adviseur zegt dat niet alleen in een jaar verbeterd gaat kunnen worden, maar dat er puntsgewijs gewerkt kan worden aan de vooruitzichten.